So, this is the uh, site of the crew that were buried from L32 Zeppelin. Um, what had happened was the crew were, after the, after the Hulk called down, etc., the 22 crew members were placed in a barn on Greens Farm Lane. Um, it was very, it was virtually on the side of the road. They were put in there for approximately two days, and the um, it said, like in a book like this, etc., which is a really good book by Ted Wright, who was a local historian. <clears throat> he used Ted Wright used to run Kate Museum in the High Street, and he really knew his stuff. I actually remember him. Um, I'm old enough to see him around. Ted Wright um, wrote the book and explained that from eyewitnesses the bodies were kept in the barn. Uh, the doors were left sort of open and people were looking. There were reports of some people just looking for a, a sort of fascination and some of the ladies um, were said to be in tears because obviously these guys are quite young. Not a nice sight. Um, after a couple of days, um, they were basically sent here. Now at the time, from pictures I've seen in the newspaper, this, this will be the entrance to where the graves were dug. So imagine this concrete was not actually here. Looks like this was put in after. And this was all dug out. And there was a board over there in the picture where you've got some soldiers standing there. These guys were going to be the buglers to do the, the last, to, to play the last post. And in this field over here, um, the locals actually came down to view the whole thing. And you can see it's, it's now a farm. So, the 21 crew members were buried right here in this plot. It's quite narrow, so I'm guessing they would have dug down, laid the coffins along each other, side by side, and then built this concrete um, border at another time. I'm guessing this would be the entrance from the pictures. Um, if you look at the picture, which I haven't actually got, but um, it does show capping stones. Um, I have got in my book, which I'm going to try and open up, a picture of... Just a second. Yeah, so here we go. If you can see that. Just try and focus that on there. There. So that would be facing that field there. Yep. Um called into the records that the captain was buried separately. I'm not actually sure as yet where he was buried, but I'm guessing somewhere around here. This is west of the cemetery. The cemetery is in a church called St Mary Magdalene, and it's the, it's the Great Bursted Parish Church. And to be honest, this is just all forgotten really, um, but it's open for viewing for the public. Um, so yeah, so th these guys were exhumed in 1966 and they were sent to a German military um, cemetery 
which is in Staffordshire. I think it's called, um, I know, I've actually forgotten the name of it. It's, um, from what I read about the cemetery, there's four zeppelins that went down and the crews of all of those guys, all those crews were interned in one mass burial together. Um, hope you enjoyed it.